Hey y'all, I'm Scarlett Bankson. And I'm Alyssa Andrew. And welcome to the Main Stage. Honey, all stars edition. Yes. <laughs> Bitch, I think we on episode, is this episode five? Six. Oh, episode six? six? Oh, okay. <laughs> Thank you for correcting me, I said. Um, and if you don't know, bitch, we have a guest every All-Stars episode, and today we have, bitch, your fellow educator, bitch, the only queen I know who can throw a football better than all these straight straight <laughs> people yeah, yeah. out here, honey, Miss Aqua de la Roja. Yes! Welcome to the show, sis. Thank you. Yes, honey, we are so excited to have you here. So, obviously, you've been watching All-Stars. What do you think about it so far? Uh, I like it. It's mm -hmm. different. Mm -hmm. It's, uh... <laughs> It's giving. It's giving. It's giving something. I want more girls though. Like I'm tired of the repeat of the girls from oh, the yeah, All Star. Yeah, okay. You're saying Ginger Home, please. I'm no, tired of her. Oh, oh, oh yeah. Ginger is funny. funny, okay? So she makes it. Send a Raja home. Oh, <laughs> not in this house. <laughs> Never in this house, honey. We love Raja here. So out of the girls remaining, besides Ginger, who are you like really rooting for to win? I was rooting for Akira. Right? Oh, oh, uh, bye, Akira. <laughs> so who are you rooting for now? It's either Trinity. Okay, okay. Cable Knight represent Atlanta. Yes. Or Sony. Okay. Kyla, oh, Sony. also Kyla, Atlanta Sony. sister. Honey, we, we love the Atlanta girls here. Yes, we do. So obviously with this week's runway, the theme was, oh my God. So we're giving you, you know, a little bit of God, a little oh, bit of black. Oh, oh, oh yeah, I thought y'all yeah, dressed like that every day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, give you very Wednesday Adams tea, honey. honey. Honey, yes. What am I giving y'all, Wendy? Wendy from the restaurant. Are you giving uh, <laughs> Haley Williams? Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. oh yeah. yeah, come on. I don't I don't <laughs> Copyright strike. <laughs> um, so yeah, the theme was oh my goth. So the girls had to come with their best goth outfit. And obviously there's lots of interpretations as we saw. And um, we're gonna rate the girls from one to 10. 10 being, yes, bitch, I know you work a hot topic on the weekends. One being, bitch, this is not giving me goth at all. What the fuck? <laughs> bitch, 10 being, bitch, I was scared of you in high school. You and all your friends wearing no platform shoes, baby. <laughs> Honey, one being, I saw this black outfit in my closet. So I just pour it out. <laughs> and then at the end, whoever has the best score of the week will be our Tyra Banks of the week. And yeah, without further ado, let's get started. Bitch, let's go. Get to it. First up, we have. The one and only Miss Ginger Minch, honey. And she is giving you, uh, I guess, kind of like a voodoo doll, like creepy child. I don't know. I gave this look a six just because I hate when people who are noticeably older, like they look older, try to dress up as a little girl. I just think that's kind of creepy. And obviously that's the look she was going for. <laughs> um, but I like the hair, and I guess that's the only thing I like about the outfit. It just wasn't really giving me God? What do you think, girl? Uh... <laughs> okay, no, I like it. Like, as a whole. I don't like the shoe. Oh, the honey, Ginger would never wear a pump, I know. Ever. <laughs> but the shoe is a no. Yeah. I like the dress, the guy. I like the concept. It's mm -hmm. given very much, like, think of a honey movie of a honey doll. Yeah. That bitch would open the closet door. Do <laughs> 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 and this highlight girl, she didn't take notes, but. I'm gonna give it a seven. Okay. It's cute. Hair, dress, it's a concept. Yeah. It's cute. Just because she still had the warning here, I'm not giving this bitch over a five. <laughs> bitch, you get a five out of 10 for me. Bitch, the day Ginger stomped in the heel, bitch, I'm giving her a 10. I don't care what else you got on. I'm just giving you a 10 because you got a strong ass stiletto on. I do not like this look. Um, I feel like if you're gonna do voodoo, like voodoo is such a scary, unknown concept. Mm. Like, bitch, come harder. You know, I wanted her to be like very creepy coming out. Bitch, give us more. Like, or if you're gonna be, or you're gonna be the old lady, be like the creepy old lady. <laughs> you know what yeah. I'm saying? Like, come out very scary, like, bitch. Bitch, I would've lived for this. She came out so, like it was an old lady. Yeah. yeah. Another thing I was thinking, she's giving very porcelain doll. Like, gothic porcelain doll. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But with the voodoo doll in her hand, it's freedom, like, she's. Like, bitch, I got mixed up at the toy section or something. Yeah, like, she could have been gothic porcelain and been okay. Yeah. yeah. So I just, I wish if she would've went fully with that, cause mm -hmm. you know, baby, give me some um, Madame Laveau, honey, yeah. the, the voodoo doctor, honey. What like, was it? Uh, oh, <laughs> oh, I know what you're talking about, I know what you're talking about, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so give, give us some of that if you're gonna like do a voodoo look, bitch, go all the way with it. And it was just, concepts were mixed in, I didn't get it, so that's why she got a box. Next up, we have Pandora Box, and I'm gonna <laughs> give her a, uh, okay. It's not bad. Like, technically, it sounds like it's a concept. Mm -hmm. Like, I, don't, I just don't like it. It's giving very renaissance. 
<laughs> party city. Like, I don't, I don't like it personally. But it's clean. It's a concept. I'll give her a six. Okay. Yeah, this looks good. You know, it's, I'm not mad at it. You I know, I never saying? thought you would say that about Pandora. Yeah, Bones. this is a, this is a. She looks beautiful in it, but this is not all stars drag. Like, bitch, we seen girls turn looks like gowns and all this shit before on the regular. Um, all stars, you know what I'm saying? It's like Pandora. I think I said this in every fucking video that I've recruited or recruited, recruited every fucking that. video that I've talked about. Pandora, bring us more, bitch. You have been on since season two. What the fuck are you doing? Like, this okay. is not elevated. Can I add something? Yes, girl. It's very like this is expensive drag. Like, mm -hmm. this dress probably costs her at least 25, 30. Three thousand, yes. whatever. Mm -hmm. But it's not—it's giving me like widow. Yeah, it's yeah. not very it's god. Odd. It's not god. Like the makeup, I get it. Like she's crying dead husband. Yeah, it's just not. No. This is what you would wear. I don't know if y'all remember that episode when they um did the Lady Bunny roast and everybody came in like yeah, Lady Bunny. Yeah, yeah. This is yeah. That. yeah, this is that. Um, very not goth at all. So yeah, I gave it. What I say? I mean, it's black. A six, but... a seven, whatever I said. Y'all know. <laughs> Um, yeah, this look, I didn't really like it. I actually would give it a five. Mm. Um, so, apparently the reference is like, I don't, I don't think it was Moog Layer, but it was like some fashion house runway. Mm. They had like the whole outfit and everything. Yeah. But to me, this looks like obviously a cheap knockoff. Like, I feel like you can recreate looks as long as like, they look like the designer would make them, not like a Party City version of it. Yeah. I'm sorry. But honestly, if she would have took this headpiece off, this would have been better. And Bitch. wore a black hair, maybe. So I was like, I when she came out, I was like, what the fuck is that? I was like, is she in a coffin? Like, <laughs> it's I didn't... like a coffee table. Yeah, I was like, what is that on her head? <laughs> but apparently, in the runway show that they did, um, apparently back in the day, you know, people would wear that because they would have their hair in like a high. Uh, uh, up to you or something. So I was like, oh, that makes sense. But then why isn't she giving us an up to you, honey? She's right. giving us a good old bus <laughs> driver wig. <laughs> so I don't know. It was just too much going on that did not belong together. So I just gave it a five. Next up, we have the elephant queen herself, Miss Motherfucking Eureka. Yes, ma'am. Bitch, I don't know why the judges live to pour this <laughs> look. This is so, like, so par for Eureka. Eureka yeah. usually delivers very elevated looks. I hated this look, bitch. I didn't understand the makeup reference. Bitch, I hated the hair. Bitch, I hated the corset, gown, skirt, whatever the fuck that shit was. Bitch, you get a three. I'm very disappointed for this one, Eureka. Like, bitch, you know better. Um, Eureka, you found it, and I wish I did it, bitch, because I hate this look. Probably my least f favorite look of the week. Um, like you said, I hated the makeup. I, the hair was okay. I didn't mind it. Well, why was it lopsided? Why was it like sticking straight up? Maybe it got stuck in the suitcase or something. <laughs> Honey, it bent a little wrong uh, while traveling. Right. Um, and then the outfit, I know she was kind of going for like goth, but like sexy, like lingerie underneath, which it was like Amazon lingerie under that like black piece of sheer fabric. So I don't know. I feel like with Eureka, it's really hit or miss with her runways this season. Mm -hmm. um, so for that, I'll just give her a three. Uh, we have the same makeup on. <laughs> Literally. Uh, I'm going to give this a four. I'll give it a little more than three, Eureka. I see the concept. I just, I wanted more. Like, this is all stars. You gave her just one point because you know you're going to see her next week in Atlanta. So you want to make sure she don't drag you, girl. Don't be mad. Don't drag me. Girl. Should I be here next week? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Interesting. But yeah, um, it's just very much a mesh skirt piece with some lingerie and a corset. And the hair, no, I don't like it. I would, makeup. Mm. I feel like this is the hair Pandora should have wore for her little coffee table. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. I mean, they needed to switch with Yeah. Yeah, I don't know what was going on with that either. That was just very confusing for Eureka. I feel like maybe she thought it would have been like a, a acting challenge or something. Everybody had to wear like something gothy or scary, whatever. Yeah, maybe that's what she brought it for. Some of these girls think black equates to goth. Yeah. Mm. It doesn't. Like, yeah. Just because you put on something black does not make you a girl. Like, Eureka look like somebody from Les Mis, like they're saying. Oh, yeah. Like the uh, brothel house. Yeah. Um, yes. Worker or whatever. But you could never tell Wednesday Adams, honey, what fucking goth is, bitch. That, 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 that is the master. Hello. Yes. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. <laughs> Man, the copyright. Ooh, the second one of that episode. You can do this time. Yeah. Yes. 
Um, so speaking of girls who wore black and thought it was goth, next up we have Raja O'Hara. Um, this is not giving me goth at all. Now she looks fucking sickening. The bitch looks right. The hair, the makeup, honey. It, I, I loved it. I actually really love the outfit too, but it's just not. It's just not a goth look to me. I'm going to that please. So I just gave it a five. I know, I know Mama has a lot to say about this one. <laughs> Conceptually, it's clean. Yeah, she's like a businesswoman. Yeah, but she's not giving up. Yeah, I don't like this brown. Is it supposed to be new? It's supposed to be new. It's not. Uh, I don't like the hair. She's looking at the picture, y'all. And now y'all know. She gotta Sorry. zoom in for y'all. I don't like the makeup. Like, give a black lip. That would have made it a little more calm. Mm -hmm. Give us some black, I don't know, give us a mohawk. Give us something, something else. This is black, black hair. Color. Black hair. Mm -hmm. The gloves are gawky, sorry. <laughs> the gloves are gawky. <laughs> the pan is cute. It's just not a concept. Yeah, it's just there is no thought. I'm giving this a four. Oh, okay. So, <laughs> I love this look. <laughs> yes, I also know it's not gawky. But I love this look, bitch. So I'm like debating, should I rate because it's not like goth? Should I rate because I love the look? Bitch, I'm gonna rate because I like the fucking look. <laughs> I'm gonna give this bitch an eight. Cause I think she like, like Aqua said, it's very clean. Um, she, everything is very, like Scarlett said, everything is very right. The hair, the face, you know, she looks good um, overall. I agree, maybe it should have been all black. Just like, again, like Aqua yeah. said. So um, even the brown, the nude. Yes, exactly. Make that piece black, yes. add some, Something flowy, like yes. something back, I don't know. Yeah, something pants, a little like, more dramatic. Not a velvet pant, like that's not very god. <laughs> they didn't wear that in your high school, girl? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's giving me an, it's giving me entrance look. It's giving me, yeah. I'm going to the mall to pick something. Like this is a cute, look. like, meet and greet look, like, mm -hmm. but the, I don't like the hair. I don't like the overall <laughs> presentation of this. Ooh, you really don't like this look, girl. <laughs> so you love the look. <laughs> Next up, we have my <laughs> current favorite, yes. Trinity K. Bonet, and bitch, I'll give her a 10. Ooh, yes. 10, 10, honey. I will wear this any day of the week. Mm -hmm. If I'm going to the Kroger, I'm putting this on. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to Walmart, Target. Yeah. Bitch, the train, don't close the door on my train. <laughs> Hold the door open. But yeah, it's a 10 for me. Makeup, sickening. Yeah. Costume, sickening. Design, everything. Yeah, and I was gonna ask y'all about how y'all feel about the makeup because I, I also love the look. I also give it to look a 10. Um, but I was a little like, a little bit thrown off by the makeup. I didn't know if it was like the eye. Cause usually Trinity's makeup is like, mm -hmm. bitch, flawless to me. Mm -hmm. You know, like you can't clock anything, but for whatever reason, maybe it was a little, I don't know if she put like an extra something on the bottom lash or something? She did. So she put a white, like exaggerated white line in her waterline. Okay. So that's why her eyes look so big. Okay. But I see what you mean. But I don't think she was comfortable doing like darker makeup. Yeah. Okay. Because it is a lot more dramatic than yeah. uh, most normal. girls are used to. Like a natural beat. Yeah. But I like that she did, like she took a risk with her makeup. Yeah, yeah. Instead yeah. of doing like the same And it paid off. Else. Yeah, and maybe she did it to make it more Mm -hmm. Goth like, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Um, which hey, kudos to you, bitch, because you can never clock me to try, bitch. These faces, these clothes got on, bitch. It's the only face I can get right here. <laughs> so, here bitch, I'm not no natural beat, no goth beat, no. Uh, honey, she said white line on the water, whatever that bitch. That sound like physics to me, bitch. That sound like fucking the crazy ass shit. <laughs> the lab. Honey, the Kim lab, the Matt lab, all that shit. I'm like, bitch, what she talking about? But okay, girl, right. let the fans know. Um, but yeah, I love this look, bitch. Yes. The dramatic headpiece, bitch. I know I love a, I love dramatic hat. Yeah. Um, kudos to Trini. This bitch can do no wrong. Yeah. What do you get that? Bitch, ten. Oh, okay. Very. Uh, yeah, I really like this look as well. I think I'll give it a nine. Um, I, Ooh. like, I get, I don't, like, it's not really giving me goth, mm. but besides, like, it being, like, black and kind of, like, she kind of looked like a Disney villain, to be honest. Mm. Um, so it's giving me very much a villain, but in terms of, like, goth goth, but, you know, regardless of meeting that or whatever, I think she looks sickening. I love the hair. I love the outfit. I think my only thing is since it was like all in black, it was kind of hard to see like it's all the different the detail. Yeah, yeah. aspects. And honey, they sped through the runway this episode, bitch. Mm, yeah. we, we saw them for three seconds each. But uh, regardless, I think she looks sickening. Um, as of right now, Trinity is my number one pick to win the season. So I'm really, I'm really happy to see how far she's gone since her season. So yes. congrats, girl. Yes, bitch, because you fucking scared me. You like, bitch, I can't wait to see the first episode. <laughs> Scarlett made me think Trinity's gonna be out. And I'm gonna be pissed, bitch. Hi. She was in the bottom, right? Yeah, she was in the bottom. Hi. But my girl stayed, honey. Yes. yes. 
Y'all, yeah, I need a break between these girls. Y'all run into the two of them real quick. Right. <laughs> the cat got some to say. That was the cat. No, <laughs> no, 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 Next, we got our girl Miss Jan up here, honey. I actually really like this look. Yes, I gave my girl a good old eight. Now, the satanic star was a little too much for me. I, like, I, take, too much, I, got, I got a little scared. I was like, take that off. Um, but I was fucking, I don't even know what you would, if you call them a sleeve, bitch, the little yeah, dramatic like thing. Like cage. Yeah, whatever it was, I loved it, honey. Um, I thought Jan was probably one of the most fierce on the runway, her and Trinity. Mm -hmm. um, and then the contact lens, just of course, Took it to the next level, so bitch, give her 8.5. I know I said 8, bitch, I forgot about the content list. Take it to a 0.5, honey, she got an 8.5 for me. Jay look good, I think it's probably one of her better runways this season yeah. so far. Yeah, Yeah. so, uh, what was that one outfit? The, so, when she went to Party City to get the little salute outfit, <laughs> honey, y'all didn't know it was a BOGO, buy one, get one free. <laughs> honey, and then she went to the evil princess uh, section of the store, honey, and picked this bitch up. Um, I really like the look, but I agree with the judges. It looks a little too costumey. Um, but besides that, I think it looks sickening. The hair, I fucking love it. Um, the makeup, the you know, the special effects with the contact, the pentagram, all of that is cute. Um, I hate that she tries to go like a little like I hate that she had like that coffin book bag. Mm. Like and tried to do like modern, young, like cool drag queen or whatever. I hated that. Like I could have done without it. Yeah, the book bag on? Yeah, yeah it was like, that. girl. It was like some little teeny bopper, like yeah. five year old. Like a cross or something. Yeah. Um, but besides that, I thought she looked great. This was one of her better runways, so I'll give her an eight for that. Okay, so I do like this look. Mm -hmm. As separates. Mm -hmm. okay. I just don't feel like it all works well together. Yeah. Like Take the thing off under, what's that, a cloak, a dress, technically, a mesh dress? Mm -hmm. Paint on just something black, like a black corset for some. I don't know, something else. Uh, don't like, I like the shoulders, but not with this look. Don't like the necklace. All these girls with the cross necklaces, like, <coughs> and they're just chunky, like, they're, 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 yeah. no. they were like, girl, they were like, girl, it's a goth runway. What it's a goth, let's put a cross on. <laughs> right. No. Uh, it's a lot. It's just a lot. Yeah. It looks like it could have been refined. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, but I'm gonna give it a seven. Like it's not a bad look. Mm -hmm. Makeup is on point. Hair is on point. Always. Jay makeup is always on yeah. point. Yeah. And it's just like all that pieces are there. They just don't work with each other to me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> They're like get you in the comments, girl. They go get you. <laughs> Tell her. At me, bitch. <laughs> Well, they hate Jan, so I think you good, girl. I don't hate Jan, though. Like, well, Jan. the internet does. I know. Yeah, I don't hate Jan either, so I don't yeah, know. Yeah, I, like, I love Jan. I, I do think Jan does a little bit on, too much on the show, but Jan is a drag queen. She's just trying to... She's passionate. I'll yeah, she's passionate. She wants to do well on the show. So, you know, yeah, she all got 100, bitch, taking down a couple notches. But other than that, you know, why the girls hate her so much? Honey, the other girls need to take it to 100. <laughs> that too, but it's also that New York girl thing. Like, a lot of the New York girls, they used to be in, like, that girl in New York. Yeah, that's true. So when they get somewhere else with competition, it's just like, they have to turn it up, keep going up, 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 up. And bitch, you like, didn't think Sally Mae from Kentucky was going to drag her ass on this RuPaul Drag Race. Right. Bitch, you thought wrong. <laughs> like, for example, Rose mm -hmm. and whoever else, they thought uh, Simone, like, yes, she was competition, but yeah. they... Or Olivia. Or Olivia, yeah. yes. Mm -hmm. And they bitch brought it too. Yeah. Next up, we have our eliminated queen herself, Miss Akiria. Bitch, I fucking love this look. It is giving me queen of the damned. It is giving me like mm -hmm. a gothic vampire bitch princess. Um, I think everything about this look works together. I'll give this a 10, bitch. Um, I love the headpiece, the cross. She looks like a bad bitch, yeah. period. So, I mean, nothing more to say about that. I agree. <laughs> 10. <laughs> Honestly, this look was everything. Like, yeah. Just the construction of it, the proportions. Well, the headpiece could have been a little smaller. I don't like how big it is, technically, but 10. I mean, I know her head was, ten. her neck was hurting from that. <laughs> That's one. probably phone. <laughs> she got it. But she's giving like Black Maleficent, like, yeah. who went to church and now she's about to exercise all y'all hoes. <laughs> yes. Period. Bitch, Akira looks like that girl who you see in like uh, a movie or like a documentary where she's like a sexy vampire and she seduce all the men and take them home and then kill their ass. Yes. Bitch, that's what Akira is giving. I also give this look a 10. The bitch slayed it. And bitch, 
the black against those perfectly white yeah. <laughs> feet. Yeah. I was like, yeah, bitch. They take that up another level. Yeah. Um, Akira was good. I don't know what that material was, though. I want to feel like. It looks like it's one of the spiky dust. Yeah, the spiky. It looked like, like it was hurt. cut out. So it looks like some kind of film or plastic oh, okay. that they just glued on top of each other. Oh, I'm like, like ooh. Yeah. Bitch, don't let me hit your skin. You're going to start bleeding on the runway. And, and she had like moment. pieces glued on her ears, too, as they already I caught that. Oh, I didn't pay attention to detail. <laughs> you at the screen like this, honey. <laughs> yeah, like the magnifying glass. <laughs> yeah, but she was good, honey. I love this look. Yeah. Sad to see our girly bitch between this look and then the fucking beautiful flower. Yeah. Akira did no fucking wrong on the runway. She'll be back. Oh, y'all heard it here first. Ten, ten, ten. Okay, next up we have Kali Sonique. What's your last name? Love that. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> sorry. Uh, again. Is it getting caught? No, <laughs> but sep I like this, them separately. So I don't like the fishnets upon her. I'm gonna start there. Don't like the cross ne necklace again. Don't like the glasses. Take the fishnets off. Take the uh, necklace off. She'll be naked. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so change. I don't like the hair. Unfortunately, don't like the red lip. Give us a high pony that slaps like her ankle. Like mm. that's all she needs. Something simple. Black lip. A black smoky eye. Dramatic. I just feel like it's it's too much. Mm -hmm. It's not enough, like. Uh, it's not enough and it's too much at the same time. Right, way. it's minimalism, but it's too much, I don't know. Mm -hmm. It's just the taste level isn't really there. Like the little strappy pieces are cute. Yeah. But I'm gonna give it a five. Yeah, I hate this look. I gave it a four. This is very um, last minute for me. And at this point in the competition, we all know Kylie is a sexy woman. We don't need to see it everyone every runway you know what i'm saying like you can be sexy for example trinity bitch fully clothed big ass train big ass headpiece and walk the runway and she still exudes sexiness you don't have to be naked i do want to see her in the gown yeah yeah and we all know like <clears throat> sonique is a powerhouse. sex siren yeah, yeah and she's a powerhouse so she can deliver in a beautiful like fully clothed gown and she's gonna sell sex on the runway yeah but she won't be naked but we know your body is right the titties is right the ass is right we don't need to see it every runway like, and then they, why you got scary, scary spice wig on? <laughs> <laughs> is that God? Am I missing something? That is scary. <laughs> spice. Right. What the hell? Uh, yeah, I pretty much agree with the critiques. Um, this is not giving me goth at all. It's giving me, I don't know what it's giving me, bitch. Um, I hate the cross. That is such, like, I feel like a last <laughs> minute <laughs> addition. Um, yeah. Everyone, never girl! <laughs> I hate the glasses, the wig doesn't really make sense for me. I guess the only thing left that I do like is the outfit itself, knowing me though, however, bitch, you know my leg would've got caught in the rock hole with <laughs> that bitch. Um, but yeah, I do want to see something different from Sony. I would love to see her in a really draggy look, um, yeah. just because I feel like a lot of her looks have been simple so far. Yeah. Maybe because the same designer made them all, but <laughs> <laughs> anyways. Well, I feel like she bought this. Mm -hmm. I don't think this was made. Yeah. And also, is that a wedge? That uh, is a wedge. Like, what the fuck? Right. Oh, oh, I live for a wedge now, I honey. Don't know, man. She should have walked. You got <laughs> a six inch outfit and a wedge on, bitch. You better have a spell out of hole. That's what I'm saying. Like, even with a boot, a like six inch stiletto, mm -hmm. and that fucking. I don't know. Uh, yeah, yeah. had enough. And I love her so much. Yeah, yeah. I so do I. But I'm like, if, and correct me if I'm wrong, has Sonique given us a drag look on the runway yet? I think she, you know, she's given all very. The Frilly one was kind of drag. Okay, the pattern was that one. The frilly. Oh, what, what was she like had a, on? The animal print? Yeah, no, it was like pink, purple, iridescent. Oh, that and, lady. Oh, jellyfish looking thing? Yeah. Yeah, yeah okay. Yeah, I, yeah, I remember that one. We throw it up. That was kind of drag. Yeah, that yeah, that's a little draggy. But that's it. Gaga was draggish. Her redo. Oh, yeah, she was. That's true. That was but that's it. Like the mash of the patterns, that mm. wasn't very draggy. Right. That was very boutique. Go get it off the rack and get it on. Yeah, all, all, and all the ball look, the. Maybe boot denim, all of that was yeah. not draggy. No. But hey, maybe maybe she'll give us a drag look. If she lasts. <laughs> okay, and our Tower Bank to the week is Akiria! Yeah! She'll be right here or right here or right here. Yeah. <laughs> She's somewhere over here. Somewhere. 
I think that's the second time she got tired of Rachel the Week. The first one was her gorgeous flower runway. Yeah. yeah. Give her her flowers. But that is the time. last time. Because she's gone. No. <laughs> no, she'll be back. Oh. Honey, she better give us a good old sickening finale look if they bring all the girls oh, she, back. She, the entrance look. Oh my God. That bitch brought it. She, what was that? The, the gold? Oh, I did not gold. like that. Oh, oh yeah, I, I love that look. I did not like that look. You didn't, bitch. I love that look. The uh, hair, the shoe, everything. Oh, bitch, yeah. I can't do no wrong. That is a drag queen, honey. Yeah. Well, her season finale was wrong, but we're not. Oh, we ain't gonna talk about that one. But I still love her, though. Yes, we do. Maybe she'll give Sonique a couple, like, drag looks that she's gonna show on the road. Like, <laughs> to still work for, work for her. Bitch, y'all are stupid. <laughs> well, thank you so much for joining us for our little oh. goth night, Miss Wednesday Adams. Oh, yes. <laughs> That's a copyright. Oh, please. <laughs> Uh, so tell the girls what you got going on around the city. If you got anything coming up, your social media. Uh, so you can catch me at Oscars every Wednesday. Oh yes. Um, possibly doing a competition soon. So follow Ooh. me on Instagram. And that's it. Yes. yes. And if you don't know what Oscars at, honey, bitch, stay away because you'll keep going back every <laughs> fucking time, honey. They get you fucked up for a good old price, honey. Yeah. Yeah, not about Oscar. Yeah. Honey, I'm about to do it in a minute. Yeah, I mean, we're working on it. It's cute. It's cute now. We yeah. have a little cute show on Wednesdays. We do trivia. Y'all come on out. Yeah. Yes. See your girl. Honey, see your girl. Add your girl, honey. Yeah, do all girl. of the above. But most importantly, <laughs> don't forget to co like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> Period. So if you don't comment on anything, or if you don't go see her, like, comment, and subscribe to this video. <laughs> And I guess that's it for the video. Y'all got anything? Yes, and thank you again, girl, for coming and, you know, showing up and shut, shut, <laughs> showing up and showing out. Bitch, I, I hit my girl up. She's like, bitch, yes, I got you. Yeah. And that's the type of bitches we like to fuck with, honey. Yeah. And my girl handled it with ease and grace, honey. Yeah. I, no, Wednesday would never. She could never. She could never, honey. I'm Thursday. <laughs> Bitch, that, that, that's, that's, that's a sickening drag day, Thursday Adams. Thursday. I'm pretty sure there's one out there. Oh, probably. Somewhere. It's probably every day of the week, Adams. Somewhere. <laughs> yeah. Weekday okay, Adams. Okay. Weekend Adams. Yeah, weekend yeah. Adams. Oh, weekday Adams would be cute. Anywho, but y'all, we'll catch y'all next week, and y'all be ready for our next guest, honey. We bring it to you every fucking episode. We thank y'all, and y'all have a good-ass day. Bye, y'all.